So picture this. You've got a swanky multi-million dollar mansion, all the bells and whistles, but then apparently someone flushed the wrong way. Drake's palace got a little too much wave action if you catch my drift. Just imagine Drake calling his insurance company. Yeah, I need to report a flood. Oh, what's the cause? Well, you see, my house decided it wanted to be an Olympic swimming pool overnight, and now I've got synchronized leaking. You know, some people invest in high-tech security systems. Drake opted for indoor swimming lessons instead. Forget alarms. He's got water slides to entertain those pesky burglars. Too bad they didn't come with a no-flood zone sign. The water damage must have been intense. Looks like Mother Nature isn't a fan of certified lover boy. Instead of selling those pricey scent candles, maybe Drake should pivot to got flood insurance, bumper stickers. Could you imagine the staff meeting the next day? Uh, so boss, we need to talk about the new indoor lake. No, not intentional, but definitely spacious and a bit on the damp side. Who knew Drake's mansion had a built-in aquarium and he didn't even have to pay extra? Hey, maybe Dwayne The Rock Johnson can make a guest appearance for a special edition of Sink or Swim Drake's Mansions edition. Next episode, can multi-millionaire rapper survive without his fire pits? Spoiler, he might need a boat instead. So audience, what do you think is more devastating? Missing out on Drake's exclusive OVO Fest tickets or having your mansion unexpectedly turn into a water park? Share your splash-tastic thoughts below. Like and subscribe, please.